What's going on YouTube? Nicholas here with Tech Love TV, where we don't discriminate and we believe all tech deserves some love. See some love, it's love day. I'm sure yeah, people love out here on the court. Today I got some truly wireless earbuds from a company called Rothstone. They're based out of the Netherlands and they reached out to me and asked me to do a review on these headphones. When I first got these headphones, I wasn't too impressed because if you watch my other videos on newer companies that send me products, I base my initial opinion off of the packaging and this packaging is pretty standard um, there's nothing much to it it's not like the liner box you have the magnetic lid and everything and the great design on the outside it's just simple and plain and and uh, I get straight to the point to be honest with you but I was very quickly proven wrong with these headphones because these headphones the sound quality the build quality for the for raw stones first time out because this product is their only product on their website for their first time out, they did an amazing job. Yeah, they're lacking in some features, but overall, um, I am truly impressed. But before we get into all that, if this is your first time here, go ahead and smash that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to hit that bell icon so you get notifications on when I drop my latest tech videos. So this product right here, the Raw Stone Novas, that's what they're called. You can find them on their website at rawstone.com and I'll have all the links in the description down below. Right now, at the time of this video, they're not available available on Amazon so I'll just have the link to this company but right now they're going for about 80 euros a hey, echo how much is 80 euros and dollars 80 euros is 91 US dollars and 29 cents so 91 about 91 dollars and with the fluctuation of currency expect to pay around 90 to 95 dollars for these I don't know if they ship worldwide they're based out of the Netherlands so I know they ship in Europe and I know they ship to the United States because I got my pair but real quickly let's go around this box so on the front you got it shows a picture of the earbuds themselves truly wireless earbuds perfect fit Bluetooth 5.0 Rothstone Nova the controls you have it can play and pause music skip and go to previous track in and accept phone calls stereo sound from two wireless earbuds turn earbuds on automatically when check, taken out of the charging case listen for five hours on a single charge and the case in here charges up your headphones four times so when fully charged you got the earbuds they have five hours of playing time four separate charges with the charging case is 20 more hours so you got a total of 25 hours with these earbuds bluetooth 5.0 powerful bass and clear highs that's pretty much it for the outside of the box let's go ahead and open this up and see exactly how the product looks when you first open them up you'll have your charging case on the inside the charging case on the outside is is a uh, Kind of like a smooth rubberized material you have two charging indicator lights on the front you have an indicator light on the back for when you're charging up the case the two lights on the front are for when you're when the case is charging up the earbuds and then you have a usb mini port on the back side and on the inside you'll notice that here are the earbuds nice nice size not too big they have pre-installed ear fins on them now i use these without the ear fins and I don't recommend it. They, they're just a better fit with the air fins on. You might have a difference of opinion than mine, but for me, the air fins are the way to go. These earbuds sit inside the case magnetically so that they won't fall out. You don't have to worry about them falling out when you're trying to take them out the case. Underneath the earbuds, you also have a box with some more items in it. You have the user manual. You have a comment card. If you have any questions or anything, they give you a number. Now the number is a overseas number, so they give you their email address. And if you use the WhatsApp, they have their WhatsApp number on here as well. And also you have your USB mini charging cable. So it comes pre-installed with ear tips on here. On the box it says it has uh, ear tips, small, medium, large, but there's two in this bag and there's two in this bag and I think you have a medium and a small in here and a large and a small in this bag so I'm not sure if that's just what they sent to me because I'm reviewing the product and if that's standard but at the very least expect small medium large ear tips for these earbuds so connectivity a lot of earbuds that i've tested with bluetooth 5.0 there's a lot of people that comment underneath my videos and tell me that they have problems connecting to their earbuds um because of bluetooth 5.0 but i want i honestly want to say that when i got these it was simple took them out the case 
turned them on simultaneously, found Rockstone Nova on my Bluetooth settings, hit it, and they connected. It was simple as that. I had no problems, and they connected very simple, just like that. Now, when I put these ear earbuds in, they don't stick out as much. You can't even see them. If I turn my head straight, you, you really can't even see them. They have a nice profile to them. They don't stick out too far. You have the two golden dots on the inside, on the top side, which connect to the inside of the case. Then that's how you charge them up. These fins are removable, um, but like I said before, I don't recommend that simply because they're a better fit with the with the air funds on. On each side, you have your function buttons. Now the function buttons do the same exact thing for both of them, so it doesn't matter. It's when you press, you're going to get the same function. So you press them one time. It plays and pause music, ends and answer phone calls. You double tap them, it'll go to the next track. You triple tap them, it'll go to the previous track. You hold them down for two seconds, it will reject the phone call. And if you hold them down for three seconds, that will cut them off. Now, you don't have to cut them off if you don't want to, just put them back in the case. And as long as the case is charged up, they it will cut off automatically. Now I was testing these out and if your case has lost all battery life and you put these back in the case thinking that they'll charge up, these will keep playing inside of the case. I don't know if that's a, if that's a flaw or if Rothstone just didn't look out for that, but I do think that there should be maybe a tiny bit of reserve battery life in here at all times so that when you place these back in the case, they'll automatically shut off. Now, one thing that I would like to see different about the earbuds themselves is if Rothstone on maybe the next version come out with an automatic shut off feature so that you don't have to worry about um, the battery running dead if the case is already dead. So when you remove one earbud, they pause the music automatically and they'll go into standby mode after a certain amount of time and eventually cut off if they're not being used. That's something that Rothstone, I think you should definitely add that feature to your next version of these headphones. It's just something nice to have. You do have two microphones on the top side of these earbuds for call quality. And yes, they are in stereo. So when you have your phone, we have phone calls coming in, you'll hear them in both earbuds and not just one. I haven't tested earbuds where you only hear it in one, but then I haven't tested all earbuds. But I did get that question on another video and I was thinking to myself, what earbuds are out there that when someone calls you, you only hear it in one ear, but that just wouldn't make sense to me. But I guess it happens because the question was raised, so I just wanna let you know that these are in stereo when you do answer phone calls. Now the call quality on here is decent. I was walking through the city and my wife called me and I was able to hear her just fine. Um, she did hear background noise, uh, the city noise in the background, not as loud as when I was talking, but it was noticeable, probably could be improved on the next version. But nonetheless, the, the call quality is not bad. Don't get me wrong, it's not bad. It's average for earbuds. I do have some Sennheiser Momentums where the call quality on those are phenomenal. And to be honest with you, that's probably the best feature of those Sennheisers. But you know what, I digress. Don't worry about that, that video is coming soon. The sound quality, I'm telling you right now. This is why the packaging fooled me. I tested these out and these, they get louder than the AirPods, my Apple AirPods. They get louder than my Apple AirPods and I'm just using my Apple AirPods as a baseline, as a measuring, as a measuring tool because people are familiar with the AirPods. But these get louder than AirPods. Not significantly louder, but just notice, noticeably louder. And the highs, the mids, the bass on here, it's pretty good. For Rothstone's first shout out, first time out the gate with these earbuds, the sound quality is very good. It was hard for me to give you an example simply because I don't know what you've tried. I only know what I've tried. But the bass on here, they're better than the Apple AirPods. And I'm going to right now set up a scenario. I'm going to test these out. I got a decibel reader on my iPad. I'm going to play 10 seconds of a song on here and let you see how high they get. And I'm also gonna do the same thing, same song, same 10 seconds on my AirPods and let you see how high they get. And we're just gonna compare the Rostone Nova sound, the highs to the AirPod sound. So let me go ahead and set that up and show you what I'm talking about. The Apple AirPods.
the Rostov Novas. So as you can see, after I did that decibel test with the Rostov Novas compared to the Apple AirPods, the Rostov Novas Max got up to 95.1 on a decimal reading and the AirPods got up to 92.5. So I know my app might not be 100% calibrated, but they're both playing on the same playing field, meaning that they're both using the same app. They're both using the same microphone on my iPad mini. So to me, the test is valid. <laughs> you might not think so, but I definitely think so. So overall, these headphones do get louder than the Apple AirPods, and I hope you can just use that as a baseline if you're deciding to buy these on how loud they get. Now, the overall sound quality is obviously subjective because what might sound good to me might not sound good to you, and vice versa. So overall, I do, I really recommend the, this product. It's Rostone Nova's first product out the gate. I believe it's their first product. It's the one, only one on their website. There's nothing else on there. So I believe this is their first product. And for their first time out, I am very impressed. I mean, the build quality is very nice. The comfort is amazing. I can listen to these for hours on end. And the sound quality, I mean, the sound quality is 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 just as amazing as the comfort to me they get louder in the airpods and that's something that i look for they they're they're loud but the sound's not distorted there's nothing wrong with the sound quality when it comes to these the only thing different that i would like to see is something rawstone if you see this it's just something that maybe in the next version you can build upon these just to stay in competition with other companies that are doing these USB type C on the back side, maybe make this case a uh, wireless charging, set it down, charge it up, and then also have an auto shut off feature on the earbuds themselves so that when you place them in the case, they shut off. I mean, so that when you take them out of your ear, they shut off and, and maybe an app so people can customize, use the EQ in the app so people can customize uh, sound better tailored to their liking. I mean, that's something that can be improved upon on the next ones, but to be completely honest with you, that isn't anything that will make me not recommend this product. If you're looking for a new set of earbuds to work out in or for everyday use, I highly recommend the Raw Stone Novas. Link will be in the description down below to their website. Like I said before, they're running at about $90. You will not be disappointed with these. That's pretty much it. That's all I got. If this is your first time here, go ahead and smash that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to hit that bell icon so you get notifications on when I drop my latest tech videos. And also, please go ahead and like, share, and comment down below. And you know, if you leave a comment, I'm going to answer. That's what I do. You take the time out to watch my video, to leave a comment. I'm going to take the time out to respond back to you, at least for now. Don't have that many subscribers. Channel still very small. So... I have the time to do that. As always, thanks for watching the Tech Love channel. My name is Nicholas, and I'm out. Peace.